It is Mimi's live stay at home wife from Almost Heaven, West Virginia. And uh, this is the uh, tag that I have been uh, invited to participate in. Lacey Space has a clean house tag. And I was tagged by the sweet Sinov Beautiful Gems. And also I was tagged by Kenya's Decor Corner. Um, this is the fourth time I have sat down to try to do this video. Um, <laughs> it's been really challenging just to get the video done, but I have it. I think I have it this time. I think I can handle it. So we're going to go through it. Hopefully this works. Um, so Lacey Space, uh, has 10 questions and I'm going to answer these questions and we're going to get this posted. Number one, how often do you clean your house? Daily, weekly, or monthly? I clean my house a little bit every day. Number two, do you have a certain style or method of cleaning? Zone cleaning or schedule or one chore a day? I do not do it cleaning that way. I am basically very extremely busy even though I am a stay at home mom. I drive my elderly mother to appointments and things that she needs to do. I babysit uh, one of her grandsons, and then I also homeschool. I am very busy, even though I am a stay-at-home mom. So I just basically try to get things done when I can get things done. I will do laundry while my husband and I watch Jeopardy!, in the evenings and it's just I just really don't have a rhyme or reason with my with my cleaning but um, number three what is your least favorite room in or area to clean that would have to be my bathroom and my bedroom I just get uh, I just never want to do that and I just <laughs> I just don't want to do it and I just have no excuse I just don't want to it just seems like that I'm in there. No one else sees that. If it doesn't bother me, you know. So, yeah. We need to work on that. Number four. What is your favorite room or area to clean? And that is my living room. I do appreciate when I go to someone's house, when I walk into their living room, and I am uh, uh, have a chance to be seated. I want to be able to sit down and be comfortable and not be throwing books or newspapers or you know a bunch of clutter off the, off of a sofa to be seated I don't like to look at a cluttered coffee table I like just to so that's why I keep the living room pretty pretty decent shape most of the time um, what is your least favorite chore to do? And that would be dishes. But I'm getting better because I'm watching the fly lady. And she is the shiny, shine your sink lady. Set your timer for two minutes. Just go get something done. So I'm getting better at that. So I'm working on that. Um, what is your favorite chore to do? And that is vacuuming. And I've noticed a lot of you talk about vacuuming. I like to vacuum. I like to have my floors looking nice and uh, it bugs me if I have dirt or crumbs or lint on the on the carpeting I just want that to be vacuumed up uh, and I have a good vacuum I think that makes a difference because if you're really vacuuming you want a good vacuum um, number seven what is your favorite cleaning brand anything Mrs. Myers I really like Lime Away. I really like SOS uh, soap pads, the steel wool to get the forks and the flatware looking shiny, get the water spots off of them, shining the sink with that. And also the LA La Awesome. The LA La Awesome I use on carpeting to get up stains and that stuff. I saw a tutorial on that on a YouTube channel. And I, ever since I saw that, I was like, man, that stuff works great. It really is awesome. I really do like that. And then, um, 
my last question was what is your favorite products my favorite products that I really love are uh, oh I did that one oh that's my least favorite products. see I told you I've been having <sighs> my least favorite is the Lysol in the brown bottle the Lysol in the brown bottle I do not like the smell of that and that really is a offensive smell to me I just do not like that aromatherapy does a lot for me with cleaning I just like uh, if the Mrs. Meyer and the things that smell pleasant it just makes it easier just to keep cleaning uh, and then the number um, do you have have you ever used a maid or a cleaning service and yes I have who wouldn't want to do that I uh, have a daughter who works for a cleaning company I have uh, a my husband's aunt is also has cleans her own business and that is a very good business to get into if you like and enjoy cleaning I uh, would for sure oh yes you know yeah have somebody to come in help me clean and also help me to get organized and declutter that was the other thing I wanted to say so um, clutter and those kinds of people that come in and kind of help you kind of declutter and then come in and clean that would be what I would probably need more than the cleaning part I could kind of do the cleaning part and my part is getting overwhelmed with uh, when things start getting, you know, I just, I'm disorganized, as it's the word I, I'm looking for. But anyway, so this was fun, and I hope that my friend, Kim, from Life of This Housewife, will participate. I'm tagging you, and if you want to do it, Kim, I would love to see you do your um, uh, advice. I forgot the hacks. I was supposed to do a hack. My favorite hack was um, the dash and stash. Like if companies coming, just throw things in a in a tote bag, da dash them and stash them under the bed, and then uh, kind of get the house like looking like just decluttered and looking kind of nice. And my sister one time, she was having um, a get together, and she just wasn't done with her kitchen everybody was coming so she just took everything put it in a, some tote bags took it out to the garage put it in the trunk of her car so yeah we got to be creative whenever you're having company over but company is probably my biggest motivation for cleaning so yeah anyway but Kim if you would like to participate you can get the questions off of Lacey Space YouTube channel and I want to thank uh, so Love Beautiful Gems and Kenya's Decor Corner for inviting me. And uh, I love you all. Thank you so much. And I will be watching you all. Bye.